In this problem, we're given the speed of a bird. We can assume that it's like its average speed or its average velocity. And the problem is asking us how long it takes for it to fly some distance. Now we've got some information about these variables, and they're connected together through the average velocity equation. That the average velocity is equal to a change in position divided by a change in time. But since we're being asked to find the time here, we can get that by just rearranging the velocity formula. So we want to solve this for t. So we can get that by first, we want to get t on its own. So we can start by multiplying both sides of the equation by delta t so that it cancels out and so that we get a, a, a t on its own. And then once we've gotten through this step, then to actually get the t on its own, we'll want to divide both sides of the equation by the average velocity to so set the velocities cancel out, then we really do get t on its own, like this. Now all we have to do now is just plug in the values given to us by the problem. In this case, the position is going to be 3.5 kilometers, the change in position, rather, since that's the distance the bird is traveling, and the speed is 25 kilometers per hour. Plug this into your calculator, and we find a time period in hours of 0.14. This is in hours because that's what the problem gives us the units in, kilometers per hour. So this is how long it takes for the bird to travel 3.5 kilometers. That is all for this fairly simple problem. I hope it helped you out. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave a comment down below and I'll try to help you out. If you'd like to talk further or if you have a request for a future video, I've got a Discord server linked in the, in the description where you can reach out and make requests if you have a problem that you'd like me to make a video on. Either way, that is all for today. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a lovely day. Bye-bye.